Hello and welcome back to Night in the Woods with me, Bardon. So, we got some leads. Can I borrow your car this week? Do you even have a license? I mean, no, regardless. But do you? Nope. No license, no credit card. Don't believe in money. You just believe in other people's cars and money. I didn't choose to be born into this society. Dot dot dot. Okay, well, I have, you know, a job. So I can't drive you around to all those spots. I can maybe do the graveyard. I need to go there anyway. Cool. I'll see if Greg wants to do the other two. You know, like... And I probably don't have to say this, but just because something happened in the past doesn't mean it's going to happen again. Hey, nerd. Ever hear that history repeats? It does. It's the same thing over and over again. So we've just been in a loop since we were living in caves? Yeah, that's science. Oh my freaking god. Yeah. May May doesn't have a very good understanding of pretty much anything. Oh, we still can't jump in the library. Oh, there's people to talk to though. Ahem. What is... Is that Miss Quelcy? Oh wow. Haven't seen her since graduation. She was always kind of a badass. School district did not fund that art program at all. But she made it work. She was like some sort of art teacher survivalist. Wow, I never realized. I think they pay her in bits of string and empty soda cans. Thank you for coming to the second meeting of the Possum Springs Poetry Society. Do you want to stick around for this? Of course I do. We love the poems. Yeah. Oh, yes, and we get to jump. Tonight we have new poems from myself and Fisherman Jones and Selma Ann Forrester. I will start us off with one of my own. She's from some big city, right? Yeah. How'd she end up here? Who knows? Ahem. Letter to my worst student. Okay, this is gonna be to May, it has to be. To my worst student. The subject of my stories. I tell friends back home. When they ask about life. Out here in the sticks. It's you. I worry. At the end of my life, you will be the only one I remember. Why did you key my car? I know it was you. Brian. Dot dot dot. Hang on. May wasn't your worst student. Thanks everyone. Is that legal? What? Talking about details about students like that. She didn't name names. Yes, yeah, she did. Okay, no full names. Next up. Oh, next up, Fisherman Jones. Fisherman Jones has a poem for us. Two. Two poems. They're short, though. Two poems. Take it away. Uh, hi, folks. Thanks. This is called Tunnel Eels. Tunnel Eels, Tunnel Eels. I do not know how it feels to be in darkness all the time, born in muck and raised in slime. But neither do you know paths, paths I've trudged 
So it's hardly. So it hardly is your place to judge. Dot dot dot. That was a nice poem. Okay, thank. That's one poem. The next one is shorter. This is called Tunnel Frogs. There's a bit of theme here. Tunnel frogs swim in the dark. Must think it would be a lark. To be a fisherman like me. But what do you know? Amphibie. Am am amphibian. No? Amphibie. Dot dot dot. That's it. Well, I suppose it's poetry and poets are well known for mangling words to, to fit them into their, into their poems, so that's fine. That's great. Thank you, Fisherman Jones. He definitely talks to the actual fish. Oh, most definitely. Finally, a poem by Selma and Forrester. Yay, Selmers! Thanks, May. You know her? Dude, she's like your neighbor. Oh! She writes these really funny, dorky short poems. I'm up for something short and funny. I always change her voice, so I'm trying to give her a voice that I can remember. <laughs> but it's not coming to me right now. This is called... There's no reception in Possum Springs. <laughs> She's not wrong. Um, um... No reception here. I wave my black phone in the air like a flare, like a prayer, but no reception. I read on the internet, baby face boy, billionaire, phone app sold, made more money in one day than my family over 100 generations, more than my whole world ever has. World warehouse buying jobs became rent paying jobs became living with family jobs. Boy, billionaires. Money is access, access to politicians waiting for us to die. Lead in our lead in our water, alcohol and painkillers. Replace my job with an app. Replace my dreams of a house in a yard with a couch in the basement. The future is yours. F Force 24 7 entrepreneurs. I just want a paycheck and my own life. I'm on the couch in the basement. There in the house and the yard. Some night I will catch a bus out to the west coast and burn their silicon city to the ground. Very good. Holy shit. Wow, damn. Huh, she rhymed entrepreneur. I don't even know what that word means. You don't know what most words mean, I think. Thanks, everyone. Is she always like this? No. Wow. Huh? Thanks, everyone. See you in two weeks. Hey, Selmers. What? I liked your weird poem. Thanks, I wrote it myself. Wait, was the assumption that she didn't write it her? Nice work, Selmers. 
Oh, Smelmer, sorry. I don't like that nickname. What, are you two? Sorry. It's cool. Can we go now? Yes, we can. Poets of Possum Springs. Oh, and then we're back. Okay, I thought we'd be able to explore a bit more. Okay, but everyone's here. Okay, thanks for coming. We live here. Right. So. Find anything about your ghost? Yeah. Tell him, Bay. There were some newspaper clippings that talked about a ghost. Not just any ghost. Little Joe. I don't really remember Little Joe. He's a ghost miner. He died in mysterious circumstances. Wow. I know, right? Mysterious. I thought you were like afraid of this ghost. Like filled with like dread and shit. I'm terrified. Okay. So, it mentioned three different places we can all check out. Uh, I have work and stuff. Yeah, Greg and I also have work. You guys skip out on work all the time. Maybe we can, like, split this up. Share custody of you and your ghost. What places were you thinking about? Uh, the graveyard. I call that one. It's close and not illegal. Is there an illegal one? Dot, dot, dot. Sure is, the historical society. You know, you don't have to, like, break in. The people there, like, get paid to show it to you. Anyway. I mean for the Historical Society. Awesome. So, what did I get stuck with? Possum jump. I know Possum jump. We used to go there in the scouts. Perfect. Okay, I need to like actually get home and do work. This is gonna be awesome. And also, I'm scared to death. Cool. Oh, back home. Hey, Dad. Well, let's check this first. Ta-da! It's Selmer's. Poet, ah, a good poet, thought, if I die, Selmer should write a poem about it. <laughs> cool. Okay, let's talk to Dad. Woohoo! Hey, Dad. Arg. Yeah. Yeah, seems like that's going around. The erg. Yippers. So, uh... Your mom had a bit of a fight yesterday, huh? Yeah. I thought you two were getting along. We were. But we talked about it. I just hate to see you two on the outs again. It'll be fine. We're cool. So, we're having money problems? What? No, we're fine. Dad. May, it's fine. It's okay, I'm 20. I can handle it. Nothing to handle. Okay. Might just head up to bed tonight. Sounds good, kid. Been a long couple of days. No, oh, I wanted to watch 
You can't watch the TV. What? No, I want to watch the TV with Dad. It's like a, it's like a tradition at this stage. Watch the TV with Dad at night. Talk to Mom in the morning. Okay, up we go. Shh. I want to check something though. I can't do anything with that. Oh, I don't want to go there. Oh, I can't do anything here. Okay. I wanted to see if there was something that we could get to use as a key for that safe. Okay. Well, let's see who sent us messages. Oh, three. Nice. Okay. Let's start with this one. Hey, let me know when you want to hit the cemetery. I should be around most nights this week. I don't know. Thanks, babe. Don't thank me too hard. I'm going there anyway, and it's like right down the road. You're ruining this. Oh, in that case, you are so incredibly welcome, and also you better not forget this big favor. That's more like it. I'm falling asleep. Had fun tonight. Sorry if I was grouchy. It's just... It's fine. Wait, did you fall asleep? I think she did, yeah. <laughs> Lol. Yo, I looked up the historical society on the internet. It's real old, but then they did big re renovations. Oh, really? I mean, listen, I'm not saying there's a ghost, but old stuff that just got torn up seems like ghost central. How so? You're a ghost hanging out in an old house. And then someone put in a pool where you died or something. Haunted pools would be actually pretty scary. I'm spooked. I'm going to bed. You spooked yourself. Well done. <laughs> hey, May. Let me know when you want to go to the park. I looked up a map and it's a pretty straight shot up to Possum Jump. Okay, great. We never really get a chance to hang out. It'll be fun, I think. Okay, I'm going to sleep. Yeah, it'll be fun to hang out with Angus. Night, sir. Tips hat. Nice. Cheers, Angus. He really is a gentleman. Okay, well, bedtime. Yes, indeed, it's bedtime. Yes. Okay, oh cool, new dream. Hey moon, okay, got that lit. Now let's not jump down until we do over here. Good, in there. Oh, oh my god, look at the poor people. Oh god, keep away from us, Mr. Weird Fish. Okay, up we go. Do -do. Wow, things are getting a bit weirder. But hey, hey ho, can I expect that? Right, let's jump over here and use it to jump back onto this one. That's good. Get over there. Hey, we got Mr. Saxophone. Does it look like there's anything in that direction? Okay, so we need to keep going this way. Okay, and then drop down, I guess. Okay. So we're going down this way then. And then let's do it here next. Keep away from that crazy fish. Okay, who's gonna be in this corner? The Phil guy, the violin? I think. Yep. Cool. 
Not you. One thing is anything else, another reason. Okay. Now. Let's head on down. Oh god, there's more crazy fish. Ah! Okay. Got a bit of a pyramid going on there. Okay. And we got this chap here. The tuba guy. And the light. Oh, things really are in a bit of a mess, aren't they? Okay, let's get that. Can we go on that one? Oh, we can. Okay. And we can get this one as well. It looks like there's something... Maybe that's just the way up, but... Go check up there later. Let's head across here. Nothing there. And I'm gonna check. Or oh, can't check actually, but just send you. I wanted to check the bottom to see if there was. Okay, we got the lamp in there, so. Okay, we can't get over there, which means that. Oh, there's a lamp. I think we, yeah, we've already been that way, so let's head back this way and start making our way up. Hey, smoking pipe man. that way at the lamp thinking, oh we've already got that and then I missed the hole in the floor. Okay. Yeah the dreams are getting more and more disturbed though. I guess we just have to find where the start is. Ah, and look at that, we fell right into it. Right. Ta -da! Okay, what happened now? Ooh, look at this thing. Oh, poor fish. Okay. Is that a heron maybe? What is it? Loves fish. check our messages and then I think we'll end the episode and then we'll talk to mom at the start of the next episode so it'll be something for at least for me to look forward to okay messages okay should be three yeah last night inspired me oh interesting for longest night I'm getting you a library card you're welcome. What? What is May going to do with a library card? Dude, my mouth tastes weird this morning. Like a tire. I'll be at work trying to wash it out with whatever's in the cooler. <laughs> Away message. Planets are to be pitied as they cannot know how big and cool they are. Dr. Cathy Con Conklin, National Astronomy Agency. Okay, cool. Now, yep, so that is the 
end of this particular episode. So as always, if you have enjoyed, please consider hitting that like button, sharing with your friends or on your favorite social media, posting a comment, and I really hope to see all of you next time. Goodbye. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, maybe you'll hit the subscribe button there on the right and check out some other videos here on the left.